All right, guys, we are back at the field. We got some stuff going on over there, but um, so we're over in the corner of the field and we have uh, Batwing version two. Uh, I added about an inch and a half uh, of nose uh, length to accommodate the battery. And we have a 30, uh, it's, a, it's like a 3200 SMC pack that's like supposed to be the weight of a 2800. So that is good, um, but it's, it is substantially heavier than my other version. So we're up at about 800 grams, all up flying weight. Um, supposed to have 900 grams of thrust, so um, should be okay. Uh, it did fly away pretty good from my hand when it did go straight uh, with the, uh, with the, what was I gonna say? Um, trying to get this hat camera snugged up good. Um, with the other weight, and it was probably about 100 grams lighter with the smaller pack, the 2400. So, on version two, I elongated the uh, the nose, and um, I brought the uh, the control horns have two holes. I went to the higher hole, which gives me less throw. Um, so I have a little bit less throw, and I added more expo, and uh, brought the rates down just like maybe 10%. So I think all those things together, I still want to have full throw just in case I need it, but I, but I know that full throw really upsets this thing. So I have to. Remember two things, throw it straight and be, be gentle on the sticks. So, all right, bud, you wanna take your position? Yeah. All right. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna do our best to just, there was a lot of wind and then now it's gone. So, uh, that's, I guess that's good. I kinda wanted to throw into a headwind with a heavier plane. So let's get this going here. Throw it level. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. I am good to go now. Oh, this thing flies great. I figured it out. Oh, uh oh. Okay, so, oh, uh-oh. I don't know what happened. The canopy flew off and then it lost control. So that is not good. That is not optimal. Let me, um, let me fix this thing if I need to, if I need to glue it or, uh, or get it fixed up. And then um, I'm gonna figure out what happened. I know something happened. The, the canopy flew off and then it lost control. So uh, let, me, let me get back to you guys and keep the video shorter because the last one was really long. All right, guys, uh, my bad on that. The thing was flying mint, and of course the canopy flies off, and then it, it, it didn't like it this time without the canopy on, which is weird. So, um, so yeah, I, uh, I put the canopy on with a, with a rubber band. Luckily, luckily I had one here. Um, that should hold it on good enough for the... Uh, for the flight, um, our CG is right where it was before. All right, bud, you wanna take your position behind the net? Pretty soon you're not gonna need to because this thing is pretty, it's flying pretty good. Whoop. All right, let's do it again. Let's get a, a good flight in. I just wanna get a good flight, a good takeoff and landing. All right. Ready? Guys, it's easy, easy to launch. Unbelievable. Oh my God, it flies so good. That wing. Oh, did it again. Why is it doing that? Dude, did you see that? It did the same thing. It just ripped the canopy off. It flies so good. I can't keep the damn canopy on. I need to have a, a locking mechanism for the canopy. 
All right. Uh, where is it? How is this happening? That's the question. Uh, it's still good. No, no cracks. Um, let's see. Let's see what we can do here. One dab that's going to have to hold this. Where did I put it? On the front left. And I'm going to have to give it a spritz. Hold it down because I cannot have this thing come off again. Um, I'm gonna need to find a mechanism, but it's gonna be easy because I got a lot of area to work with on it. Uh, okay. I wonder if it's lifting from the back from pressure. That could very well be. Um, hmm, how can we do this? All right, I glued it. I glued it, I put a dab. I'm gonna put one little tiny dab, I can cut it. One little baby dab right there, okay? And, okay. All right, we're good. Now it doesn't, doesn't need this anymore. Doesn't need that. Okay, CG, same spot, good to go. Okay, we got a secure canopy. It can't fall off. You ready, bud? All right, adjust the hat cam, oh. Let me, let me adjust to zoomed in so you guys can see everything in the distance. All right, here we go. Nobody's over there. So now I can fly wherever I want. No people to worry about. All right, ready? All right. This thing is actually very easy to launch. Um, you hold it with two fingers on the exhaust. Ready? Oh, that was close. That was a close one. Just when I say it's easy to launch, right? I'm gonna fly with the sun at my back. I think I may have a servo glitching because it, ha it, it did some weird violent thing and it doesn't do it when I'm just flying. Look how, look how stable this thing is. Whoop. Might have a little bit of servo flutter or something. Fly so good. Plenty of power with a 50 millimeter, guys. A 50 millimeter 4S. On Believable. Oh. Okay. I don't know what that was. It flies so great. I mean, it doesn't do anything bad. Sometimes it wants to just dip its nose. I'm not sure why, because the CG seems very good. Stall characteristics, it's really not anything to talk about really. Tyler, is there, are there any people on the field over there? What? Are there people over there where I'm flying or no? No. Oh. Yeah, it did it again. It wanted to drop a nose. I don't know why. I gotta figure that out. Let me see what happens again, here. It flies so good though. Like everything is on point, perfect, perfect, perfect. I wonder if it's the intake catching a wind gust or something. Oh, just drop the nose again. 
because it was downwind. So, um, should we try a roll? You know what? I'm going to bring it in for a landing. No, I'm not yet. Hold on. I'm not going to bring it in just yet. <laughs> All right, ready? All right, so nothing happens with that. It's, I'm actually downwind right now, guys. Look at that, yes. All right, let's check the voltage. Oh, I can't check the voltage because I have uh, my canopies taped shut. Huh, it's glued shut. All right, let me... Uh, how long did I fly for? I'm not sure. We're in perfect condition. We got no issues at all with anything. Everything looks fantastic underneath. This thing is a, it's a great flyer. Um, it was dropping a nose a little tiny bit. I think I have the CG spot on, so I don't want to mess with that. Um, let's see. Let me let me do this real quick. Okay. All right, guys. I. Uh, I just swapped the battery out. I re-glue the canopy on, which is so ridiculous. But, um, all right, we're good to go. I'm gonna chuck this up. I wasn't able to really, I had people over there before and now I don't. So um, I'm gonna fly this thing again. Now I get to fly it a little bit more and go out a little further and do some more things because I know I don't have to worry about people. So let's throw this thing up. Oh yeah. Oh, why does it do that? I'm gonna put a different, I gotta put a different uh, receiver in this thing. All right, I wanna try a roll? Yep. All right, it handles, it handles maneuvers. I can roll it. It flies really good, guys. I can't even believe it. I really can't. It flies so good. This is off throttle. No fan running at all. Now it's not doing anything weird. So I, I, I don't know what, what the dip was. I don't know if it was uh, just a little bit of a glitch in my receiver. I don't know if it's my Expo that's uh, acting a little wonky. I don't know. Might have been Expo problem. It might have been flutter in the uh, in the control surface. I don't think it was anything because I haven't felt it at all this flight. Off throttle again. It's not doing any anything like it was before. A little bit of wing rock, but that's okay. A lot of my planes do wing rock. I can't believe this. This is this bat wing is 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 so good. I just can't even, ah, it's not doing any of the weird stuff anymore, which is so weird. I really wish I was in my normal spot in the middle of the field so I can like fly by you guys, but, or by, by the camera better, but I kind of right here, ready? There we go. I'm just scared to fly over the factory over there on the right. All right, I got two more passes and then we got to wrap this up. Look at this thing. Look at it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to save the battery so I can keep, look at the birds following me. <laughs> they know, <laughs> they know what this thing is. <laughs> now it's, now it's flying absolutely fine. No issues. Oh man, I don't care if I burn this battery up. I don't care if I lose $45. It's been absolutely dead on this flight guys. So the CG is back just a hair. All right, I gotta bring it in, seriously. I, I'm gonna kill this battery. Yep, no issues. No issues now, guys. Plop landing. You can plop landing a freaking bat wing. Jesus Christ. 
<laughs> this has been the most nerve-wracking one, guys. This has been the most nerve-wracking. This bat wing, oh, I, I, all night, like last night, was it last night? No, it was two nights ago. I was like thinking to myself, um, was this a fluke? Did I just have every condition perfectly right where I would never get this thing flying again? Uh, I shouldn't have doubted myself because this thing is fantastic. Um, I can't wait to get more batteries. Um, I only have two right now. And once I fix the canopy, I'm gonna be able to, uh, to get some more flights in. But wow, guys, seriously. Um, I, I, don't, I don't even have words. There's nothing else for me to do um, uh, to the, the design. It's done. It, it's, it's, it's finished. Um, you can run, I, I wouldn't run anything smaller than this in terms of battery because it's, uh, it, you get a longer flight time out of it. Oh, you know what? This is probably going to burn down in here. I got to take this apart. Um, I want to try and not break it though. So yeah, uh, long story short, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what else I can do to the design. If you, if you guys think you're ready for this, uh, Look, there's no gyro. You, you do not need a gyro to fly this thing and to fly it good. Um, I got, I'm going to break this thing. Uh-oh, I did break it a little bit. That's okay. I can glue that part back on. Um, oh, come on. Come on. All right, there we go. There we go. Bend that back. Hold on one second. I just got to... I want to wrap up my thoughts real quick. I'm going to just take the... Uh, unplug the battery because it's, it's getting really hot. Okay, so uh, the only thing I can think of is maybe a cheater hole or, or um, a vent hole for um, for a little bit of air in there. Uh, so I may put a tiny, I don't want to screw up the aerodynamics, but I'm thinking like a little NACA, maybe underneath, I'll put a little NACA hole and see how that works. I'm gonna cut one in tonight and uh, just to get a little bit of cooling in there for the battery and the ESC. Um, but that's gonna blow the canopy off. So forget that, scratch that. Um, I am going to, I, I'm gonna think about it. You guys let me know. This thing is ready to rock and roll. Uh, it prints out great, goes together so easy. Uh, and it is absolutely amazing. Um, I, I might do two more flights. I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna come back tomorrow and do two more flights, and then I will, uh, I will report back to you guys. Thanks for watching.